What's up, YouTube? The question is, what is fenugreek? First of all, fenugreek is a plant, a leguminous plant. But you have to realize that there's more than one useful part of this plant. So for the purpose of this video, I'm going to be talking about the seeds. Fenugreek seeds. I've got some on hand. I'll show you how I consumed them. But first, we're going to learn a little something about fenugreek. It's been around at least 6,000 years in and on the record. Fenugreek seeds were found in King Tut's tomb. It is an ancient medicinal plant or herb with unique chemical properties, which we will talk about. Let's break it down. Dr. Greger did a video back in the day about fenugreek, citing this study, which is also found in his book, about resistance-trained males boosting their powerlifting output on a fenugreek supplement, which happened to be an extract and not the whole plant food. This study also mentions some interesting details like the well-established role of fenugreek in the regulation of insulin and hypoglycemia. So potentially some blo blood sugar regulating effects from this plant, from this herb. Also, this study mentions that fenugreek has been shown to be a useful remedy in combating abnormally elevated cholesterol. The purported increases in strength in that first study are astounding and worth looking into for yourself, but I also want to bring to your attention another study that examines the anti-cancer properties of fenugreek. This study mentions that traditional Indian medicine has used fenugreek for the treatment of elevated cholesterol and elevated triglycerides, and that school of medicine dates back thousands of years. And the study summarizes by saying that fenugreek seeds possess potent anti-cancer properties. All right, let me give you an idea of what to expect. I was able to find some whole fenugreek seeds at a local specialty health grocery food store in the bulk section. The seeds are too firm to be chewed up on their own. They will break your teeth most likely. So what I did is I soaked about a teaspoon of them at a time in water for a couple hours, and they'll absorb some of that water, and then you can just chew them up. Personally, I think they taste gross. They, it's, it's one of the most bitter things I've ever tasted. Um, so I just literally soaked them and ate a spoonful of them right before I ate a meal. Um, they will make your sweat smell like maple syrup. And if you also consume curry powder, you can expect that the smell will be amplified in your sweat body odor. You're going to smell like maple syrup and curry. That's probably going to happen. But... Hey, if you're getting gains in the gym, man, got to do what you got to do. So what else is in fenugreek seeds? This is some of the unique plant phytochemical properties. We're talking about flavonoids, alkaloids, coumarins, vitamins, and saponins, and some other stuff I can't even name. Can't pronounce that stuff. So this is not going to be the basis of your diet, fenugreek seeds. No, just another element from the plant kingdom which might provide some form of micronutrients you can't get anywhere else. So check it out.